Hello everyone and welcome back to Extreme Gaming Fever and guys welcome back to another video about Farming Simulator 23. So Farming Simulator 23 we have just seen the gameplay trailer of Farming Simulator 20 and many creators who are Giant Software's partner are also sharing gameplays of Farming Simulator 23 so we have a lot to discuss. So previously I made a video about 10 things, myths or features that are confirmed by the gameplay trailer and the gameplay video uh, about Farming Simulator 23 and in this video this is basically the part 2 of that video and I have a lot to say because uh, you know the new stuff is coming out rapidly. So let's go and talk about the very first one and that is the 2 level fertilizer. So in Farming Simulator 20 if we fertilize our field once that's all we need our yield then would be 100% because Farming Simulator 20 allows you to fertilize your field only for once and once you have fertilized your field uh, no more fertilizer is needed for that particular field but Farming Simulator 23 is taking things even further because now we will have two levels of uh, fertilizers in Farming Simulator 23 because uh, now if you want to fully fertilize your field you have to do it twice instead of once uh, make sure that you fertilize your field uh, on different two times on different growth stages you cannot fertilize your crops on the same growth stage uh, you have to wait for a while and when the crop enters the next growth stage then you can fertilize the second layer of the fertilizer that's something new i thought i should share this with you because that will change gameplay a lot because the natural fertilizers such as the slurry and manure will uh, make more sense because so now since farming simulator 23 will require you to fertilize your field twice so now the use of manure and slurry is uh, somewhat makes sense this time so the number two is the versatile tractor so this is something i am not sure if it's uh, it will be available for mobile players as well because as i mentioned uh, in my previous video that some of the vehicles will be part of a dlc so you have to purchase uh, some of the vehicles because they won't be available on mobile devices at the time of the launch but if you are switch player then there is a good news for you uh, another very interesting machine just revealed and that's the versatile tractor it's it's a really interesting and powerful tractor mm, I, I don't think many people uh, just simply prefer the case IH quad track but this is a very nice new addition to the game so I think it will be interesting to work with this tractor the next one is very important and probably i saw a lot of comments about it a lot of people were talking about it and that is the sugarcane so some of the gameplay footages that were available on youtube in those videos you can see sugarcane in the crop list but we never saw any sugarcane related gear in farming simulator 23 or any harvester or any seeders so it doesn't make sense and uh, when I reached out the community coordinator he mentioned that no there will be no sugarcane in farming simulator 23 uh, if you see the name in the crop list that's probably because the game is not final it's not complete complete yet and uh, some of the things in that game doesn't make sense so sugarcane is one of those things because you know we all know that farming simulator 23 is basically farming simulator 22 which is which giant software has ported on mobile devices so we can see a lot of stuff from farming simulator 23 uh, 22 is removed to make the game playable on mobile devices so sugarcane if you see the sugarcane in the crop list that doesn't mean sugarcane is coming in farming simulator uh, 23 at least it's not coming at the launch of the game maybe developers may add their add this crop in future updates i don't know about that but at the time of launch there will be no sugarcane in the game now the next one is the manual header attachment now this is really really interesting because uh, in farming simulator 20 we can simply drive our harvester next to the header and the header connect itself to the harvester but this time uh, you have to do it manually when you drive your harvester near the header it won't connect itself 
with the head with the harvester you have to press a button and then the header will be connected to your harvester so that's really interesting and i guess uh, it's something new which is coming in farming simulator 23 the next one is the vehicle customization so a lot of people are still asking in the comment section if there is going to be any sort of vehicle customization in farming simulator 23 so the answer is no you cannot customize any vehicle in farming simulator 23 vehicle customization is not available in farming simulator 23 so that's the answer for you guys no vehicle customization in farming simulator 23 you cannot customize your vehicles in farming simulator 23 the next one is the vehicle selling option so in farming simulator 20 uh, there was this issue that they could not find the option where they can sell their vehicles so uh, it's i guess some sort of a, a game design flaw in my opinion because uh, developers should have uh, guided at the player where to sell their vehicles but yeah it was hidden in the main menu in the vehicle section so selling vehicle selling option is now improved in farming simulator 23 now uh, next to shop you will see a marker and if you park your vehicle or tools inside that marker and then you tap on that icon or go to that trigger and tap on that icon you will be able to sell your vehicles or tools from there so uh, that's really interesting it's still new and it will confuse a lot of beginners or uh, newcomers who have never played any pc version of farming simulator it will confuse them a lot because they are not used to something like that but I'm here for you <laughs> so this is how you can sell your vehicles in farming simulator 23 and don't worry you can also sell uh, your vehicles in farming simulator 23 like we do in farming simulator 20 but this is another option so you can sell your vehicles there are two ways to sell your vehicles in farming simulator 23 the next one is the silage so silage is now kind of almost confirmed uh, that it's coming in farming simulator 23 because obviously we have some specific tools that you know kind of give us a hint that it's coming in farming simulator 23 we have the mixer wagons which uh, basically mix the hay and silage it will produce tmr and tmr is the new thing thing that your cows will need to feed on so i'm not really sure if uh, if tmr is actually coming in farming simulator 23 but the one thing that is for sure coming in farming simulator 23 is the silage so silage is coming in farming simulator 23 and now it's confirmed that it will be in farming simulator 23 so guys this was the video about some of the more some more things that are confirmed or some of the myths that are now busted about farming simulator 23 i hope that you will enjoy this video and if you do so please make sure you leave a like and also subscribe to my channel and don't forget to check out the description of this video you will find some useful links in the description of this video and i will see you in my next video very soon bye bye